who was the leader of the Hardys of Afghanistan. In other words, who was Afghanistan's man of the destiny. In this video, we are going to show you the ups and downs, facts, information and secrets of the former president of Afghanistan, Hamid Karzai. Karzai graduated from Habibia High School in Kabul and later received a master's degree in India in the 1980s. He moved to Pakistan where he was active as a fundraiser for the Afghan rebels. During the Soviet Afghan War in 1979 and 1989, and its aftermath. He briefly served as Deputy Foreign Minister in the Islamic State of Afghanistan government. In July 1999, Karzai's father was assassinated and Karzai succeeded him as head of the Popalzai tribe. In October 2001, the United States invasion of Afghanistan began and Karzai lead the Pashtun tribes in and around Kandahar in an uprising against the Taliban. He became a dominant political figure after the removal of the Taliban regime in late 2001. During the December 2001 International Conference on Afghanistan in Germany, Karzai was selected by prominent Afghan political figures to serve a six-month term as chairman of the Antrim administration. He was then chosen for a two-year term as interim president during the 2002 Lajarga. It means Grand Assembly. He was then chosen for a two-year term as interim president during the 2002 Lajarga, which means Grand Assembly that was held in Kabul of Afghanistan. After the 2002 presidential election, Karzai was declared the winner and became president of Afghanistan. He won a second five-year term in the 2009 presidential election. This term ended in September 2014 and he was succeeded by Ashraf Ghani. During his presidency, Karzai was known in the international community for his charisma, his tribal ruby and lambskin hate and for being an alliance builder between Afghanistan's communities. In later years, his relationship with NATO and the United States became increasingly strained. This was meant to be a day of agreement, but many left feeling more confused than ever. The lawyer Jirga, which is a gathering of Afghan representatives, was overwhelmingly in favor of the security pact with the U.S and want it signed immediately. That was in reference to President Karzai's announcement on Thursday that he won't sign the deal until after elections next April. On Sunday, he stuck to his position that he needed more time to get a better deal from Washington. 
That didn't satisfy the head of the Jirga, and the drama on stage played out live on TV. I want to repeat again, Americans cannot go into our houses after the bilateral document. They cannot kill anyone in their house. The Afghan people will be safe and peace will come. It will not be a case of Americans sitting in their bases and then we have a war in our country. I don't accept that. This decision is historical. Whatever the president is saying is right, that Americans do not have any right to enter Afghan houses. They have given us that in writing and they promised. A superpower cannot break their promise. If they do, then we are ready to protest. Sir, no protests. Terminating the bilateral. They have to promise that they are not killing Afghans in their houses. They have to do that. Okay, all right. Then sign this first. If they break the promise, then we know what to do. No, first they have to prove it. You sign it. If you don't sign, will be upset. And he has been accused several times of corruption. He called the Taliban his brothers and warned that the heavy-handed counter insurgency in Afghanistan would only revive the Taliban insurgency against the former Afghan government. urging the U.S. to instead focus on bringing Pakistan's support for the Taliban leadership to heal. But the U.S. largely ignored his requests. After the Taliban takeover of Kabul in 2021, Karzai stated the Taliban did not capture the city by force, but rather were invited by him in order to prevent chaos. He said that in order to gain international recognition, the new Taliban government needed internal legitimacy, which could be achieved through a general election or lawyer jirga. So thanks for checking out the video, subscribe if you didn't subscribe yet and in the comment below write down your favorite person or someone, a celebrity that you really want to know about. Next time I will make a short video on their life story so that we can learn something from there.